Hello YouTube. This video will help you to imagine and draw a four-dimensional coordinate system. First of all, what is four dimension? Four dimensional dimensions is a coordinate system with three spatial dimension and one time dimension. We represent three dimensions with the help of three axes: the x-axis, the y-axis, and the z-axis. When I learned geometry, it was fixed in my mind that dimensions should always be perpendicular to each other. So according to my method, this will be the first dimension. Perpendicular to it, this will be the second dimension, and perpendicular to both of them, this will be the third dimension. We can clearly see there is no space for the fourth dimension, so we can make no line perpendicular to the three of them. So my method leaves the time dimension sad. So what's wrong? How can I make time happy? Of course, my method to perceive dimension is wrong. The right method would be a collection of dimension give rise to dim dimension of the next order. Didn't understand? Fine. Let's take a point. A point is zero dimensional. A, point, a collection of points gives us a line, which is a one dimensional. A collection of lines gives us a square, which is two dimensional. A collection of squares gives us a cube, which is three dimensional. So now, what is four dimensional? Have you ever purchased a camera which takes videos at 30 uh, or 60 FPS? Here, FPS means frames per second. 60 frames per second means that the camera takes 60 photos in one second. By playing these photos continuously we get a video. Now we can better understand four dimensions by combining the two ideas. Let's take five three dimensions. Each dimension shows a body moving in space. Here each of them is com comparable to frames in frame per second. The middle frame will be the origin, the left will be the po negative axis while the right will be the positive axis. The four dimension has four coordinates, the x, y, z and t. Your x, y, z are the spatial dimension which represent the position of the body. The t is the time dimension which represents the point of time. 